what's up youtube this is your girl paul mama so um today guys i just want us to talk i uh, just want us to connect um i just want you guys to let you in into my life <laughs> um well i go by the name of paul mama so uh please guys don't forget to like and subscribe tell your friends tell your family tell your cousins cousins <laughs> to like share subscribe and please don't forget to comment okay <laughs> uh well guys actually i'm driving well this is not my car this is uh, it's not my car i don't have a car guys please i don't have a car uh it's a long story so let me just not try and explain and complicate things <laughs> oh today as you have seen the title guys yes how it's like to be a small youtuber um the first week experience on youtube well well, it's not easy. It's not what I thought it could be. I thought YouTube was fun. You know, you just you just make videos and upload those videos, okay? Well, in reality, it's not like that. <laughs> I'm sorry, guys. My voice sounds so squeaky because, you know, um it sounds so squeaky because i thought it was fun <laughs> and in reality it's not fun well it is fun just to be honest with you guys it is fun it's a lot of fun um it's fun the thing is editing editing videos Ooh. it takes so so much time because I'm, I'm an immature um, in editing. I never done video production before. Uh, I know nothing about uh, editing videos. I'm inexperienced. I mean, amateur when it comes to that. Uh, but. When you want something, you work hard, you Google search, thank you Google, you find things, you upload, uh, sorry, you download tutorials, you go to YouTube, download tutorials, there's so many tutorials about video editing, uh, beginners uh, tutorials of Adobe Primo Pro, iMovie, there's so many softwares whereby you could uh, edit your videos after shooting your videos. Uh, video editing to me, it's really taking my time. It's eating my time. I have sleepless nights now. <laughs> I have experienced sleepless nights. But it's all about hard work because I've got a dream. I did not just create this channel for nothing. There is a goal behind it. Uh, I'm working, okay, guys. Let's let's start with this. I'm working every day. I go to work, okay. Uh, I don't like it. I don't like it. I feel like it's not me. It's not who I am. I feel like I'm being pushed in the corner where I can't do anything, where my voice is not heard. I I, I, I like to talk sometimes, but I, I believe I'm a born entrepreneur. So my plan is to have this YouTube channel, push this YouTube channel because I'm falling in love with the camera now. It's something I, I did never, never in my life I thought I would uh, do this. Like, tech always 
with a camera like take pictures i don't like even taking pictures i don't like even carrying my phone okay but now things have changed because i have seen youtubers being being successful you know guys yes being a youtuber it's work it's work and it's fun it's fun sometimes and sometimes you know it's so exhausting when it comes to video editing uh, but to me as much as video editing is draining my energy so much every day when i come back from work or gym it just drains drains it all <laughs> Well, guys, if you want something, if you have set your, your mind to something, if you have set your goal to achieving something, then what is hard work? What is video editing? Those, all of those things just seem so easy. I'm not saying it easy, but when you want something so bad, you make sure that you do everything to achieve that so as i said before uh video editing just drains me it's one part i don't like about being a youtuber but i'm starting to love it because i have set myself a, a goal and i have a dream of why am i doing this why do i want to have followers why do i want to have subscribers why do i want people to to look up to me okay so guys this video is all about telling you anything is possible uh, whenever you have told yourself you have set your, your, yourself you have set your dreams um, level up level up level your dreams uh, tell yourself you can do it no matter what guys listen you don't need a person you don't need anyone to motivate you okay the key is to motivate yourself that's the key the key is to motivate yourself i do a lot i go to work there's some things i do on the side beside work because i've got a goal okay guys as i've said i'm not happy work working up waking up every day going to work um it's taking a lot of time taking a, a lot of time guys do you understand it drains me it drains me because i feel like it's not me it's it's not who i am because guys you don't understand this thing is so to me it's so important and uh it, it hurts me sometimes I prefer taking a leave, a one man leave, just be, just to become myself, become who I am, you know. Uh, I have to be not at work, just to be me, just to be free, just to love who I am. I'm not saying being at work is a curse or I'm, or something, or I'm, I'm blessed and I'm not grateful. No, listen guys, I'm so, so, so blessed and in nowadays unemployment rate is so high i'm happy but i'm not happy i'm blessed yes i'm grateful that i have a job yes but i'm saying i've got a goal my goal is not to become an employee okay i was born to become someone's boss's boss <laughs> do you get me you know um i love I, I i love working on myself okay guys i just love working on myself um pushing myself uh pushing myself setting my strategies setting my vision my mission because i'm very good at pushing myself like as i said before you need nobody 
to push you in order to become who you are supposed to be you know um guys please please guys like let's let, let's become who we were supposed to become let's not to, let's not be pushed or let's not be drained by our work our daily jobs our daily jobs are so draining in such a way that your goal you sometimes sometimes you end up or you die not achieving what you were supposed to achieve or what you were supposed to be okay so sometimes our daily job are just are just draining us I, uh, I, there's that thing I don't like about a daily job okay but it's good for living and renting and paying our bills you know um, but uh, let's try uh, what I'm doing now it's really out of my comfort zone it's really out of my comfort zone I'm not a, a person who likes cameras, who likes taking pictures, who likes taking selfies. Um, I don't like even carrying my phone. Uh, sometimes I forget my phone at home. Um, I'm, I'm just that person who's not social, okay? Uh, I don't even have WhatsApp. I just recently downloaded Facebook. Crazy, guys. It's, it's, it's crazy. It's crazy. Sorry about that, guys. My phone just fell while I'm, while I'm driving. Yes. The problem is low shading and the robots are not working. So it's difficult. So as I was saying, guys, uh, let's, let's get out of our comfort zone. Let's be who we are supposed to be and who we are supposed to become in life let's enjoy being being successful and working hard to be successful let's try and do something that something that's totally out of our comfort zone let's get out of that comfort zone guys this is get to tell your family your friends your cousin cousin to like and subscribe and share and please don't forget to comment I like those comments. <laughs> I'm out. Oh, before it's, before I go out, guys, please tell your family and friends and, and your cousins, cousins to help me out, quit my job and do what I love. Peace.